What's happening guys? I'm Curtis and we're not fiberglassing today. That's right, uh, we're not fiberglassing today. It, uh, I found out that I'm gonna be away from, uh, from the shop here for the next two weekends. So all the work for this episode and for next episode is just gonna be in the evenings. And I don't think it's gonna be, uh, I don't think it's gonna give me enough time to really dig into mixing up resin and, and, and pouring it. So we're gonna do something else today. Um, we're actually gonna get started on the tunnel. So I've got the motor in, I got the rear axle set up uh, at maximum bump travel. So it kind of gives us where our height needs to be. I think it ends up being like a 10 inch tall tunnel. So we're just gonna grab some uh, some square tubing, build one of the hoops, and then we're gonna have to bend some of that round three quarter inch. But we'll get onto that in a minute. So let's uh, let's just start cutting steel. got this uh, ooh, it's a little warm still now we got that hoop in uh, the next step is gonna be the uh, there's pieces that go from this hoop up to this node I guess they're gonna be a bit tough because they got to be cut in three dimensions because they they both angle up and out um, and I only have a 2d brain so there might be a little bit of filing to fit but We'll figure it out. Let's uh, let's give it a whirl. We got those two bars tacked in there. Um, the camera battery's going. <laughs> the camera battery's going dead. My wife just got home. She's over there dancing in the window. So we're gonna leave that there. I'm gonna go in and see her, and we'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. I'm out of here. We're back. 
I got a haircut. Feeling fast. Let's get back to work. All right, so last night we got these two forward bars welded in. Um, the next step, logically, is we gotta go from this upright that we put in back to this upper cross member on the rear bulkhead. So we're gonna do this at a three quarter inch round, and then there's gonna be a little kick up at the back. So let's grab some, uh, grab some tubing and bend her up. the dimension of that bend, just as long as both pieces had the exact same bend. So we achieved that. We'll, uh, we'll dump the sand out of these things and uh, cut them to fit. the episode this week uh, we got basically the entire tunnel defined um, I'm gonna have to put in some cross bracing and a couple more uprights and stuff on the uh, on the main section of the tunnel but I don't want to do that until we have the proper drive shaft made so that I know where the u-joints go and what my clearances are like so we're just gonna leave it like this for now uh, I'm, I'm happy with it it uh, it's a big win so we'll leave it like that. Uh, next week, next week's gonna be another short one because I'm gone the, the, the next two weekends. So we'll dive into something that, uh, that that's quick and easy that we can kind of knock out in the evenings. But uh, until then guys, uh, thanks for watching. We'll be back next week with another episode. 
and uh, throw me a subscribe if you haven't already uh, or toss me a comment if you see something you like or something you dislike let me know and until then I'm out of here